Hello and welcome to Cop Connect. This is an orientation series for all the hackers who have volunteered to contribute to the initiative of Cop Connect in order to fight cybercrime more efficiently and successfully. As this initiative is volunteering driven, we have allowed flexibility in the hours you contribute every week for this project. In the coming lessons, we will cover a number of aspects ranging from initiating a case, the moral code of ethics, all the way to closing a case successfully. So to begin with, we need you to understand how CopConnect works in the first place and how you will be contributing to this program. So what is CopConnect? CopConnect is an initiative of the Information Sharing and Analysis Center in order to fight cyber crimes by acquiring assistance from experts in information security. The objective of this program is for hackers to assist law enforcement in order to solve such cases which mostly do not even reach the inquiry stage and are closed due to lack of expertise and operations. So how does CopConnect work? CopConnect is a mobile application which can be downloaded by anyone. Although it can only be used by law enforcement or other officials nominated by their superiors and approved by Isaac. Next, once an official logs into CopConnect, he or she will be able to access the database which will include basic information of all the hackers who register for the program. They will then send you a request in order to assist them for a crime which might be under the purview of the specific cyber cell. So what are the next steps after receiving a request on CopConnect? Once you receive a request from a police official, please keep the following things in mind. Make sure it is not a personal favor being asked by the person for personal gain or vendetta against someone. For this, please ask for the copy of the FIR and the initial complaint. A digital photograph can be accepted and this should be submitted to Isaac for filing purposes. Please make sure the name of the police station, number of the complaint and number of the FIR is clearly visible in the photo. Please ask for the lawyer's name if applicable. Also, you are free to negotiate a fee for your services from the police or the clients themselves. For now, these things should give you a smooth start in initiating a case in CopConnect. In the coming lessons, we will look at the other aspects, including the moral code of ethics. Thank you.